Hi, I'm Lynn Rutan. I've been a middle school librarian in Holland, Michigan for many years, and I now do a lot of consulting work that still involves books. My favorite book to talk about today is The Evolution of Calpurnia Tate by Jacqueline Kelly. Outstanding, wonderful book that pulls you into to, to her world from the very first sentence. Calpurnia, or Callie V, is 11 years old on a hot, dusty Texas summer in 1899. She is the middle girl between three boys older and three boys younger in a family of seven. And Callie V is looking for who she is. She loves nature, she loves to think and to read, and one day she decides that she needs to go check a book out of the library. Origin of the species. And when she goes to the library, the librarian tells her no. She is crushed and goes home. And when she talks to her grandfather, miraculously, he pulls out of his bookshelf a copy of Darwin's wonderful book. So begins a wonderful relationship between Callie B and her grandfather. This story, though, is a book that spans ages, I think. Yes, it's a book for younger readers, 10 and 11, but this is really a book for older students and readers, too. This is a book about finding out who you are, discovering what your place is in the world. And in Callie V's situation, it means perhaps discovering that you may not be able to do the thing you are good at. What happens with Callie V? Who is she really?